in in time. So here it is, my mirror drive door, power my G4, and it actually has an Marathon computer top on it to be able to stack it. But so we have the processors there, the RAM there, there's a 512. Here's the video card. I plan on filling up every single one of these slots with USB, airport, more displays, and hopefully another one so I can have six displays running at once. And I need to put an airport card in, but if I have my airport thing here, it should work. Just that. Your cards. It all looks a little dusty. I have to spray it out. So there is only one drive in there. There's the hard drive, but it's capable of having four, and I actually have two other ones I could put in there, so I plan on putting those in there. The power supply, which is huge. Yeah, definitely very dusty. It looks like the door right there got stuck on the processor. Max, what are you doing? So the door actually got stuck on the processors. So I'm going to try to wiggle that out and hope everything's okay. Hi guys, so here's now the follow-up to my unboxing of my MDD. And it's all set up right now. I got it on a 23-inch cinema display, ADC of course. And I got my dock all set up. Even got 2008 Word on there, the best it can get. Let me just show you system preferences. There's actually a line in the screen, I don't know if you can see it. But, there is. Yeah, that's what I got on there. It's not the dual. I do have two gigabytes of RAM, so that should help it go. Right now, my Wi-Fi is not working. That's the only thing. It's refusing to connect to it, so I'm not sure why. I do have the external on there. But the computer runs really well. It's in really good condition. I ended up taking off the top mount and put it on real handles. And I really, really like it. I'm not sure if I'm going to be keeping it because it's not a dual, so it's going to be a little slow. And I might get the dual 1.42 and then use this as my downstairs computer. Because it is still a very nice machine. I'm just something quick that I forgot. My cinema display, like a lot of other ones, has no stand on the back. Yeah, it's a USB port stick. But there's no stand on the back, so I actually am holding it up with these two speakers. They're Infinity. It's cool how they're just coming out of the back like this, and they're holding it up pretty well back there. But, I'm going to try to make a real stand for it, but it's nice because I would have had those speakers there any anyway, but now they're hidden. I do want to connect some pro speakers from an iMac G4 because I think this is the only other computer that can use them. And that would be really cool, but yeah, so comment, rate, and subscribe. My new video will be up soon. Bye.